Hello and welcome back to video games. I'm Shala. And I'm Pixel Cheesecake and today we'll be gaming with Shala. We'll be and assuming that the game hasn't secretly crashed on us. Yeah. One of those game one of the games that you picked up. Yep. Which is uh it's called Synaptic Drive, and it's a spiritual successor to the Custom Robo games. Not to be confused with Chibi Robo. That's, a, that's quite a difference that I think canonically they are the same size. Fun! Yeah. At least the the one game that I played, it was like you you like just like this big, and then you just kind of like put them into like a digital uh, uh, ring to fight it. Nice. to have toys made out of them. Yeah, I think I'll uh, turn it down just a little. You good? Yep. I think we'll just uh, skip the tutorial and figure it out as we go along. Yep. Sounds good. I have uh... All right, oops. That's fine. All right, there's not many. Uh... No, never mind. Oh, a gun that's triple. Talk about some real damage. So it's a um, no, plus for when you're done. Yeah. But I, uh, when I was uploading uh, videos to the channel, 
uh, one of the chair, one of the videos got a, a copyright claim. Which one? Uh, James Bond. It was Bastard Chai. I knew Skyfalls kind of screwed us up. So I'm blue. Yes. Dabu di dabu die. Ooh. Ooh, I can teleport. Gotcha. Do, yeah, I can do a little, a little jump in, jump out. So let's see, which one's the ultimate? Um, I'm just. I'm just pressing buttons at this point. Yeah. Thought of uh, something we could talk about. What's that? Uh, you have the ability to make. You have uh, the recipe for two pills, uh, but you're only able to make and mass produce one. Would you pick the one that would instantly allow somebody to regrow any body part, or? the other which allows them to uh, transition without any problems let's say that uh, I would say regrow body parts so if someone regrets transitioning they can transition back uh, I don't think there's a, there's a a lot there would be a a lot a big uh, market for that kind of thing. This the primary market would be to help people regrow limbs who lost them in com combat. Yeah. Okay, that that's fine. Say that the uh, that the gender pill even like changes you down to the chromosomes and that uh, you could e even uh, you know produce life. Hmm. Uh, Did we knock each other down? Yes. see Menorsen. So I can actually get 
hurt by hurt by my own Think about it now. Uh, yeah, there's a, a story I heard where that the uh, the guy who uh, created insulin patented it for only one dollar because he wanted it to be, uh, you know, and like cheap and easy to access. Yep, and the idiots who claimed it as their own got lambasted on Twitter. Mm -hmm. And their stock went down so bad because Elon Musk allowed anyone to make any type of account. Mm -hmm. oh. So, due to people in America being hurt, people are now going to be al be allowed to bu to buy insulin for one dollar again just so people can stay safe. Yeah. Mm. That's, uh... You know, uh, uh... Supply and demand says that the more demand, the more you can cut, you can, uh, charge for a thing, but I don't think that should work for, you know, literally life-sustaining medicine. I agree. Okay, I'm, I think I'm good. Yeah, I am. I am. Uh, well, basically recording my entire uh, play time of this game, so I literally have nothing unlocked. <laughs> Next time we play, everything's going to be unlocked, and you say, you'll say, I got a little addicted to this game, so I played off camera. Just have the equivalent of gold, golden guns or whatever. Yeah. Aw, we have the same idea. Well, well, you you can unlock everything in um, them fighting herds, and I'll unlock everything here. Uh, looking at this on uh, at uh, on Steam, and I w and one of the tags was esports. Uh, Every game wants its own esports league. I th I only want one game to have an esports league. Uh, which one's that? Team Fortress Two. Let's say that you can pick for there to only be, uh, you can pick the, like, top five, uh, eSports leagues. Which ones are you picking? Team Fortress 2, okay. Overwatch, so we don't have low skill players in the Team Fortress 2. Yeah leagues. Uh -huh. That's the Splatoon. Okay. Starcraft. Classic. And Dwarf Fortress with randomized objectives. Mm. Uh, Have you ever played Dwarf Fortress? I know it's a 
hard game for crazy people. Yeah, that's why I want it to be an eSport. Random primary objective mm -hmm. with automatic disqualifications. If five cats die, you're you're disqualified. Yeah. Why were the cats dying? I'll tell you why. And you're gonna laugh at this. Okay. The cats were walking through the bars and taverns mm -hmm. and then cleaning themselves. So, cat walks over alcohol, cat licks alcohol off paw, cat gets drunk, yeah. cat gets too drunk, cat dies. Yeah. I'm coming for you! I think, uh, I think for my one, I would have a um, Street Fighter, uh, StarCraft 2. There is a Sesame Street typing slash fighting game. Mm -hmm. I would love to see that be an eSport. It's like Street Fighter, but you type. I assume that's a, a fan game. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I thought I fell short. Yeah. You walked into... Yeah. I think I got a hang of the controls now. Yeah. Imagine we end up... I... I, I won the matches in a... Them fighting herds, and then you end up winning all the matches in Synaptic Drive. That'd be hilarious. Yeah. Oh, I see. We're just going down the list of all the maps. Yeah. So that. Yeah. Playing wherever we feel like. Oh. Are we just picking the right, the first, the starter characters, showing off the random maps and hoping they sponsor us? That would be, uh, I, it would be fun if they did. Uh, Get this video out to them, guys. Gals, non-binary pals. You bitches and hoes and non-binary bros. Bitches and bros and non-binary hoes. That's a, a dumb thing. So one of my coworkers asked me to ask what's my go-to phrase for pissing someone off. Mm -hmm. I asked just one person. He said yes, so I said, good evening, everypony. And he looked at me like I had three heads, so I guess he... So I guess he got what he wanted. I think I saw some clip of someone saying every pony over at like Walmart uh, intercom. I 
I was trying to get the final kill with my sword. Yeah. I was, uh, wisely, uh, keeping my distance. <laughs> if you had control over a Nexus-style game, which... Which set of IPs would you use? So like basically like what a uh, umbrella company I could. Yes. I want. I want a Jack Black fighting game. Yeah. I feel like. Um, and I think the uh, games like uh, what's the game where it's the uh, those like Shaggy and Scooby and little Shaggy Velma like the Warner Brothers characters multiverses yeah, that one. I think those uh, work because they uh, they're all owned by Warner Brothers. So yes. I don't think Jack Black has a in his contract for any characters he's ever voiced or portrayed. He has rights to turn any of his char make his characters part of a fighting game. Mm -hmm. He demands that in the contract before he does the work. Mm -hmm. Poe. Versus Eddie Briggs versus Helmet Full Bear. You can't tell me that wouldn't be a kick ass game. That would be a. What would you uh, call that game? J the Jack Black Invitational. Mm. Or that would be the name of the tournament. Yeah. I, I thought heard me you know the Yeah, the round one fight. Just his kind of voice. Thing that's just Round one. Let's jack it. The big, the his last name's Black, so the big Black Multiverse, Big BM. <laughs> I think he would be on board with that so to such an extent. Yeah. Double Fine would be down. Yeah. Well, he, uh, he has a. He's on, uh, he's a good friend with that company, at least I believe so. Yeah, I want to make a game with you, but it's got to be the best in game ever. So, what show would you, uh, if you could just remove one thing off of Netflix like it never existed, which thing would, would you want it to be? Uh, 
Um, big mouth. Thank you. I mean, I'm sure they're. I'm sure it's. The caveat is you have to add a third season to another show. Uh, Netflix shows have a, have, have third seasons. I know it'd be weird for for a third season to be added when to fix plot holes in the first in the second season that made the show gave the show issues uh, I mean right now uh, Netflix has a big old graveyard of one season only shows Centaur World has two seasons there are a lot of pe people having problems with the second season what I would love to see is a third season where everything gets resolved or flashbacks while traveling to give characters the tools they want, the explanations of their backstories. Mm -hmm. And I really want to see a fight between a human and a centaur just over a random, over a random character. Yeah. You've won a couple of these, I've won a couple of these the same way with them's fighting herds. Yeah. I feel like this could have used a second kickstand on on the other side. Wait, uh, did that blow up? Uh, which, uh, canceled after the first season show would you, uh, would you, uh, give a second season? There are two, but I want to see if you have the same answer. Okay. Um, well, for me, I want to, uh, have a see the remainder of Dora Hedora adapted. Yeah, that would be good. And then for the lesbians, I'd give them the second season of First uh, First Blood. Yeah, that'd be that'd be a good one. I mean the. Like, from what I've heard and seen of the show, it's the it's basically watered down um, True Blood. It took me a second to remember. Yeah. Honestly, I don't get why. People got obsessed over vampires. Cause sexy. I'm surprised they haven't gone with any other creatures. Oh. No, seriously. Golems are made out of clay, and you put the. what orders you want them to do on their on their chest or on their mouth or in their mouths. Yeah. Most uh, vampire fiction, the vampires are uh, sexy, rich, and 
powerful. So, it's like, I mean, how you, you, how in You'll be my uh, sugar pick, my uh, glucose guardian for just a little nibble now and then. I'll, I can be down for that. How, ter how tragic would it be to be immortal, though? Think about it. Say you've been alive since the 1400s. That's at least 500 years of seeing technology advance, improve, see how speech changes. Mm -hmm. Yes, but then that gives the the vampire all that sexy brooding energy. My grandmother still uses a flip phone. Imagine, if you will, someone with the a fourteen hundreds mindset walking around modern day. Like, I don't understand any of this. I understand electricity is particles moving at such a rapid rate that we can't track them outside of cables, but... <laughs> and them turning on TV. Mm -hmm. 16 and pregnant, all these pregnant... All these pregnant babies or whatever. Yes. Are we not leveling up by playing these types of things, or am I losing it? I, I think I have to uh, do like an arcade mode to level up. Hmm. Good to know. Yep. How could I do that? Do what? Oh, that's how. Let's see how how long I can keep myself alive with four health. Not long. <laughs> I think uh, I uh, I never answered uh, one question, which was uh, what uh, IP you would use like RP umbrella and I uh, my answer would be uh, the char all the characters created by Go Nagai I could see that That would be awesome, because we I went on a sign of co sign on in terms of the whole Jack Black idea. Yeah. Just 
if it were called a, the big black multiverse, yeah. people would think, oh, this is exactly what the world needs. And then the, it's just filled with Jack Black, and it's so much, and they think, it's so much better. Sorry, CDO, you know how that is. So Luigi on on Twitter says Dark Souls, finding a purpose and reason to go on can take you a long way. Elden Ring, a broken world can still be mended with enough ambition. Sekiro, hesitation is defeat. Bloodborne, do not go to London, worst mistake of my life. There was an anime edit of George W. Bush. Someone whispering in his ear. Wait. Yeah, they'll pay. They'll pay with their fucking lives. So what's the So what's the So what's your favorite type of pickup line to use on a partner that you haven't gotten to use yet? Uh, one I, uh, one of, you know, kind of uh, one that uh, comes to mind is uh, yeah, if we call it, if you call this Thanksgiving and this Christmas, do you mind if I visit between the holidays? <laughs> There's one that I tried to get away, tried to get away with, but I hadn't haven't gotten to yet. Mm -hmm. Hey baby, are you in the microwave? Cause So what I want to try and do, just use the microwave filter on my phone, mm -hmm. make the beep sounds and have it, and just spin while it makes the sound. Yeah. That, and I saw a 
kids next door number TikTok. Yeah. I still want to try using, but yeah, down the line. You might actually get half me th this time. GG So, apparently Everstone doesn't work on Tandem Mouse. Mm -hmm. uh, that's hilarious. Uh, well, can't you only use uh, one stone for Pokemon? Yeah. Doduo is two Pokemon, though. Or two heads on one Pokemon. Magnemite is three. Three. Uh, I think a, a tandem mass is only uh, really just holding hands and not connected. Oh. Probably.
Oh, I see. The more you charge up some of these guns, the better they are. You recover from a knockdown quicker than I do. Just felt different, I guess. Watch Earth be so famous for its wanted destruction and violence mm -hmm. that it becomes the battleground to solve the stupidest disputes on. Yeah. I think that was a book series. Like, oh. the... was it like Animorphs? No. Sort of like that. I think the series was called Something Carbons. Mm. Altered Carbon Carbon sounds right, but I don't think it's correct. The definitely not an uh, audio problem. What's a Seinfeld clip that lives in your head rent free? Uh, not that there's anything wrong with that. Mine is. I've gone as far as I can go with George Costanza and Jerry says is this su the suicide talk or the nickname talk? Classes that should be mandatory in high school. Nutrition, money management, taxes, how to build and keep good credit score, establishing a job slash career, account, and self-defense. Oh Kids are in school for how, mu how many months? About eight, seven, eight, depending on the type of school they're going to. Yeah. Each month, do a different, do a different type. Fencing, boxing, judo, karate, yeah. and have an after-school activity for each of the self-defenses to further the career, yeah. if they want.
A paper wizard, a scissor wizard, are standing together. The rock wizard's missing. Where's the rock wizard? The paper wizard says, I haven't seen the rock wizard in a while, but I've crafted a suitable replacement. He made a paper hat and put it on a rock, mm. terrifying the scissor wizard. Uh, go for a couple more rounds and then call it. Sounds good. That was a PB. There was a thing about a PBS commercial mm -hmm. right before their big telephone. Mm -hmm. They had a Muppet in there each year. One year is with Big Bird. Yeah. I think this was the most recent one. Yeah. And the I showed Andrew the picture. When you get the job after lying you on your who? resume. You show who? Shala. have to use our silly internet names on the video pixel. My apolo my apologies. Big Bird kinda threw me for a loop in terms of Did I knock myself down? You might have. Mayhaps. Methinks. So sometimes I, my brain goes, uh, thinks that the jumping, the uh, A button is the firing weapon for some reason. It's the triggers and the Y button, I think. And that was enough of memes I just blatantly ripped off of Tumblr. <laughs> hey, if P PM Seymour can get popular from just reading Tumblr posts, I think we should get some more subscribers for doing what we do. than just the two we've been using as we're playing as. Yeah. No. Since we only got uh, one girl, I'll, I'll uh, stick to her.
Have you ever picked up a big dog who thinks they're too big to be picked up? And someone takes a picture of the look on their face to show how bamboozled they are that they got picked up? Oh, cool. Imagine the, uh, the look on their, fire, uh, their faces would be uh, the complete surprise. It's one. Of, it's one of my two favorite animal type animal based genres of photography. The other one is cats not prepared for motherhood. Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, I'd say my uh, favorite uh, video one is a uh, animal getting uh, one treat that they uh, like toy treat thing they love, and they yeah. just avalanche of toys and treats. You ever see the the video with the uh, the ferret? Oh yeah, that's fun. It's just flying down the stairs like oh yeah, and it's just like. <gasps> <gasps> Can we big sleepy? Keep yawning every five seconds. I offered you a sip of the uh, one thing. Mm. Yeah, I haven't used Twitter in a while. Is it still a dumpster fire? Uh, I don't know. I don't really. Uh, Interact with that uh, side of uh, Twitter. Okay, this guy does a Shoryuken, I guess? Uh, I guess. These seem to have a... Yeah, some some company keeps calling me called Wireless Caller. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure who who it is, but I assume it's one of those one one things. Uh, uh, scam. Yep. You ever like listen to a uh, voicemail somebody has left here and it's like final no final warning notice here and it's like a bit of a panic for a second and then it's like your payment for your car is overdue. It's just like phew. I call I call them back and say, Hello, Joe Mama's Pizzeria 
Three in Haberdashery, also home of Sam and Max Freelance Police. Where would you like your your explosion, and how big would you like it? I think you got me. Unless we tied. Oh. Did not expect to win that one. Are we... Uh, there's a, a video of a, uh, one of the guys who uh, did like a sort of sting operation on an a Indian call center. Yep. And so he, uh, he like played like harmless pranks on them. They were like including like a like a st like a stinks and a fake bugs yep uh, I think the the favorite detail was that he uh, he got into their like security cameras and he could like he'd be on the phone with one of them and he like and he'd say their real name to them, which would, like, cause them to freak out. Clackiest Clogs, you've been caught scamming. Alright. We've, uh, reached the hour mark that I think we can call it. Oh, that's what it is. I'll check the number when I... I'll verify the number is the same as when I... On my bill when I get home. Uh -huh. But this has been a fun sloppy slap fest. And uh, another episode in the books of Gaming with Shala. We will see you... In the next video we record. I'm Pixel. And I'm Shala. No funny A word next to gamer. The uh, acrimonious. Perfect. Shala the acrimonious gamer. And Pixel. And you're watching on channel Pixel Cheesecake. Look, look out for us. Uh, on our next videos. Bye bye. Bye bye now.